First open start and type control panel. Open your control panel. Open network and internet. Open network and sharing center. Open change adapter settings. Right click your network adapter and select properties. Select Internet Protocol 4. Click on Properties. Select Use the following DNS server addresses. In preferred DNS type, 1, 1, 1, 1. In alternate DNS type, 1, 0, 0, 1. Press OK. Close the window and your problem should be fixed. If that didn't work. Open start and type MS config. Open system configuration. Go to the Services tab. Select Hide all Microsoft services. Now click on Disable all. Go to the Startup tab. Click on Open Task Manager. Right click your services and select Disable. Close the Task Manager window. Press Apply and then OK. Press Restart. If that didn't work. First open Start and type CMD. Right-click Command Prompt and select Run as Administrator. Press Yes. Type SC Config Wowser Start equals Auto and then press Enter. Type SC config bits start equals auto and then press enter. Type SC config crypt SVC start equals auto and then press enter. Type SC config trusted installer start equals auto and then press enter.
Type, exit and then press enter. Restart. If that didn't work. First open start and type services. Open services. Locate the Windows Update service. Right-click it and select Properties. In Startup type select Automatic. Press Apply and then OK. Press Start the service. If your service is already enabled, press Restart the service. Now restart. Open start and type troubleshoot. Open troubleshoot. Click on troubleshoot windows update. Press Run the Troubleshooter. Wait for the program to detect your Windows Update issues. Press Apply this fix. Wait for the program to repair Windows Update. Close the troubleshooter and restart. If that didn't work, Open Start and type Recovery Options. Open Recovery Options. Go to Advanced Startup and click on Restart Now. Click on Troubleshoot. Click on Advanced Options. Click on Startup Settings. Press Restart. Press your F4 key. Open a folder and go to C. Open the Windows folder. Open the Software Distribution folder. Delete all the contents inside this folder. Now restart.
Now run Windows Update.